Hey, this is Greg Shields, and you found the sixth course in my learning path on the Windows Virtual Desktop Topics and Technologies that comprise the AZ-140 exam. I am author evangelist and a full-time author here at Pluralsight, and I've been working with virtual desktop technologies since the earliest introduction of virtual desktops. So much of our exploration in this learning path thus far has focused on the highly graphical but entirely manual tasks one accomplishes in the Azure UI. Managing your WVD environment in that graphical location works great for a lot of everyday activities. But what about those situations where command line automation can assist? At the same time, even other graphical tools can be extraordinarily useful for things like troubleshooting, monitoring for behaviors, and even backing up your data with an eye towards disaster recovery. All of these are the topics for this course. In this, our sixth course, we begin by recognizing the need for backup and recovery solutions for our Azure resources, along with the planning requirements to prepare for disaster recovery. Then we move into command line automation, working through a series of real world use cases where PowerShell and Azure CLI bring a useful assist. Finally, we explore the monitoring tools Azure provides for understanding the behaviors of resources in a WVD infrastructure. By the end of this course, you'll better understand the kinds of metrics and logs that are important for troubleshooting common WVD issues. If you've just been tasked with designing and or managing a Windows virtual desktop environment in Microsoft Azure, this course is your next stop in brushing up on those skills for success. And then from here, you'll be ready to continue on the learning path as you begin to implement Windows virtual desktop in your production Azure environment. Let's get started.